Uh, so yesterday, um, well, Comic Con has been going on this week, and yesterday they had the Spider Man Two Marvel, uh, panel, and they dropped a Spider Man Two trailer for the story. I've seen little screenshots here and there, like the one here of Venom. I've seen, uh, but I have not watched the whole thing. So yeah, I'm excited to see it. Uh, obligatory also, I'm still sick. So, uh, if I have, like, cough or something, sorry. I also have a cough drop in my mouth. So, if I sound a little weird, that'd be why. I am very excited for this, though. I 100%ed the first one. Uh, almost 100%ed Miles Morales. I'm even sitting here now. I got a second chance. And I'm gonna take advantage of that. But I need you with me, Pete. That's what the new Peter looks like. Then he looks better the than the remaster looked. I still think I prefer the original, but that's like part of its bias, because when I played through the first Spider-Man, it was before the face change. But I think I think the new face model looks better. Why did they give Miles that haircut? It's so ah. Uh, he looked his hair looked so great in the previous two games. I didn't know there were bears in these woods. Hey MJ, okay. I have another name for you, Craven. Craven. He's here on some kind of hunt. You know if you need me, I'm just a call away. You don't know what oh, that's Mr. Negative. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! Damn, there's that lizard looks good. Oh, yeah, we got some actual footage of Venom. Ooh, he looks good. He looks so good. And then, God, I can't wait for this game. This is gonna be so fucking good, dude. So let's go through it now. Obligatory. Uh, Harry, there's Harry and Peter. Uh, again, I think I think Peter looks so much better in this than he did in like the um, <clears throat> the, like remastered when they changed his face up. I think I think just facial structure wise, this looks better. Uh, again, I'm partial to the original because that's what I played when the game first came out. I'm not gonna sit here and try and go through the dialogue and be like, ooh, what could this line mean? I'm excited to see the new areas. Cause um the I know that the the previous map is still in the game, but they've added on a bit more to to um to New York. Guys, like this area. Uh yeah. Man, Miles looks like a fucking black character from a like a riot game, like League of Legends or Valorant. I, I just don't think that hairstyle looks good. I've I've seen like a handful of posts and it's it's a uh, it's like when white developers try and do it. And I mean obviously like I have no say in it, but I don't know. I I thought his hair looked great in the previous two, or even just go the um into the Spider Verse hair. Also, I think I'm. I, it's great that the MJ's hair is down because we can finally get to that point where female characters don't have to have their hair up because <laughs> it's like too hard to like animate. But actually, I think I prefer her with her hair up. Hey, good to meet you. Good job, huh? Still gonna have time for tutoring? We'll figure it out. I didn't know there were bears in these. This reminds me of Spectacular Spider-Man when he runs into Craven at the uh, the museum. What? When they have the fight in the museum. I know it's not a museum, but it, I don't know. That shot there reminded me of it. MJ, we saw the spider flyer. I wonder if uh, they're they're gonna give Craven some special stuff, like in like in Spectacular Spider-Man. I I recently watched it, so like my brain is like, ooh, Spectacular Spider-Man. But um, I wonder if they'll you know give him like a serum or something to make him better. Mechanical dog. Ah, oh, fuck, I forget. It's, it's man-made, right? The symbiote is man-made in this one? It's not a, um... It's not alien? No, if you need me, I'm 
just a call away. I'm curious to see. I assume, I assume, um, the symbiote bonds with Harry, right? Harry or Norman, Norman, one of the two. Uh, we haven't seen Brock, uh, like at all in the previous game. And, uh, we haven't gotten any hint of him. And I think they even said it's not Brock in this. So I assume it's Harry. I assume they're making Harry Venom. There's Mr. Negative. I know that they're going to, um, I heard that they're going to have, oh no, what am I, what am I looking at? Right here. It's right in front of me. They're having Miles confront him. Uh, I assume that's just a grunt or henchman? There. And we've seen some of this footage. God, that, <laughs> that, that looks so scary here. How, how he drops in. And then this looks really cool. This reminds me of a fucking, like, Batman scene. Um, oh, specifically in uh, Arkham uh, City. At the beginning, when you save Catwoman, you just drop in on a room and there's, like, tons of guys. I mean, granted, that happens a lot in the Arkham games. But you know what I mean? You just drop into a room and it's like, oh, it's a shit heap of guys. All right, well, I just gotta beat them all. I'm excited to see um, sort of what new gameplay plans they have for, like, different units. You know, like, kind of evolving on the combat. This was our dream. Like how Batman got the shields and the knives and the tasers and stuff like that. I'm not going to lose you. We're going to heal the world. Alright, hold on. Is it does it say heal or kill? Heal. Got it. Um Yeah, I bet it's Norman. Or uh, I bet it's Harry Osborne. Hell yeah. I am very excited. It's gonna be so fucking good. We're we're definitely gonna play this a shit ton and um a shit ton on stream. We're going to heal the world. And enter new chapters in their lives as they balance their responsibilities as the protectors of Marvel's New York. Harry Osborne, Peter's best friend, returns into his life. It's absolutely gonna be him as Venom. Uh, Miles looks to build his future beyond high school. The relationship between our heroes is tested and strange as the symbiote appears to threaten them, the city and the ones they love. Uh, what does this lead to? Just the pre-order stuff. I know that they, they revealed the, like, PlayStation 2. Uh, not PlayStation 2. <laughs> uh, PlayStation 5. That had, you know, Spider-Man skin on it and everything. Uh, yeah, there's different additions. Additional photo mode items. Eh. <laughs> um, pre-order incentive items. What is, uh... What does it mean by incentive items? Because right now, I mean, the only thing worthwhile in here, I probably would be the suits. I Spider Man Two Collectors Edition suits. I think they showed this a while ago. I just don't remember it. Uh. So I believe the bottom ones are Miles. <laughs> yeah, of course the bottom ones are Miles. Look, you can see Miles' hair right there. Okay. Uh, Not crazy about this, them. I probably am just going to get the base edition, and then they're going to release all of this for... um. Oh, actually, it's only $10, though. That's not terrible. Let's see. This edition. Pre-order incentive. Oh, it's it's that stuff. Okay. Agree, sure, whatever. That's cool. Too early unlocks Peter and Miles, uh turning him into vaguely Assassin's Creed characters. Free skill points. Web gadget. Flux edition content. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I'm for sure probably just gonna Well wait, do you not get the pre-order incentive items if you buy the standard edition? Weird. Uh, but cool. I am very excited. 